Hello, I'm Arnell from Mimi's Keepsakes. Today I'm back with a Marguerite Miller collage challenge. I'm trying to catch up. So I am doing week 29. The prompts are something that um, turns or spins, a key, a ticket of any kind, a portion of a brochure or an advertisement, a building, and the bonus is a place. So, I got a couple of things here. Just move my chair a little bit. Um, I have, this is my journal. So let's see, something that turns or spins. I have these little charms, little cogs. And then I also, and then for a key, I also have this, which I, so I don't know what I'll use, this little steering wheel from a boat. And then these key charms that I might use. That's a key, a ticket of any kind. So I have a couple of tickets here. And a portion of a brochure or advertisement. So in this book, this is um, King of the Road. I found this at a thrift store. And I found this little advertisement for a bicycle. And this also turns. <laughs> and then what else? A building. So for a building, I have this book on the history of architecture. So I'm sure we'll find a building in here somewhere. And then a place, I have this beautiful book, Donna Hay Seasons. And there's lots of beautiful photos in here that I thought I can pick a place, you know, something. Anyway, so let's start with the background and then go from there. So week 29. So over here, week 29. So what are we going to do for a background? I feel like maybe I want something pinkish and let's just, these are already done so let's put this behind and what can I put behind the book so I don't have pink paint all over my desk because of course that has happened numerous times, won't be the first time I have. Um, and another page. Okay, I think we're good. So I'm going to spray some of this. Just want to give the page a bit of a pink hue. And um, let's see if we can maybe add a little bit of ink on the edges. Brown I thought would be good just to age the background a little bit. And um, maybe I can find a stamp. Let's do this one is Tim Holtz collection and it's etc. And shall we do this for a bit of printing in the back? And maybe now I lost some of the pink. I think I need a little bit more pink here. Maybe overdid it with the brown. Just in the corners. And maybe now I overdid it with the pink. Who knows? We'll see where this goes. I don't know. Just clean my fingers. Already messy. So 
This is vintage photo and let's stamp some of this here. And a little bit over here. It is still somewhat wet, so I hope it's okay. Put some of it on the edges. It's not just, you know, Maybe some here because I don't know what I'm going to add to the page. Okay, that should be good. And then let's see. I can get rid of that now and all of this. Okay. Let me cut out this advertisement. I just kind of cut it out roughly. So yeah, how have all of you been? Is it warm where you live? Let me know. It seems like everybody's going through a heat wave at the moment. Um, this one says a cut of ordinary and I kind of like that. So maybe I will I'll call to, uh, put that away somewhere and maybe I'll add it. Okay, so we have the advertisement, something that turns or spins. That turns or spins, and I'm thinking, should I add? I can add this somewhere on the page, so we'll leave that for later. Oh, look what a mess I made! And a key we'll leave for later too, because that will be a little dangler, um, a ticket of any kind. So we have I have three tickets here. Oh, we'll add that somewhere, maybe something like that. Okay, a ticket of any kind, a portion of a brochure that we have, our advertising, a building. So come, let's look for a nice building that we want on here and then a place. As we do, let me see if I can get this big book and you can see what's in here. I kind of want like a, just a sketch of a building, not a photo of a building. That's what I'm thinking. Mm, that's nice, but maybe too much. Okay. It has to be something in here because this book is about architecture. The town of Boston, that can go for a place as well. Um, Hmm. Let's see. I would like a sketch, maybe, like I said, not a photo. Hmm. And now you can see <laughs> what's in this book as well, because I'm kind of going through the entire book. I didn't, I should have looked for something maybe beforehand. That is nice. That's an option. Don't know if you saw that on the bottom there. That's an option, I think. And that might be too big, I think. thinking something like a church. I don't know why, but... Or a palace. <laughs> I think we'll get the drawings of a palace in here somewhere. Ah. Nope. No such luck. We might have to go with that one. There's a couple palaces, but no drawings. Hmm. 
That one's too long and narrow for my page, but I suppose I can cut it smaller. Hmm. Anyway, it's um, it's beyond hot today. It's 38 degrees and we are boiling. The air conditioning is running overtime <laughs> and um, we are staying inside. I'm f filming on a different table because it was just too, um, just way, 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 way too hot in where I normally film or record. So I don't know about the lighting, but let's, that's an option too. Let's hope this works out well. Okay. Why aren't there any drawings of these? buildings. It would like the Big Ben in London would be nice, but in a drawing, that's what I want. Okay. Okay. I think the decision is made and I'll just pick that one. I'm sorry. I can't find exactly what I had in mind, so we'll go with this. It's close enough. Okay, the history of architecture, and then a place. So these would be the bigger images. Oh, that looks... I wouldn't mind being at the beach at the moment. It would be so nice. I love this book. I don't know if you've ever seen this book. I love that. That is cute. Just see if there's something else that speaks to me. But as you can see, the photography in this book is absolutely amazing. And it's, um, so that's an option. There's so many, it, I think it covers all four seasons. So definitely lots of photos in here that you can use in your journals for sure. Ugh, the beach. <laughs> I would not mind being... This would just be too big for my page, unfortunately. That would be beautiful. Now we're into autumn, but let's just see what this book has to offer for autumn and then I just have to pick something all right so a place oh I already said we're boiling today so <laughs> the beach would be perfect but I suppose it's if it's hot like this today it's too hot for us to sit I wonder if I should do that. I can cut this smaller. I don't need to. I love that. I don't have to. Oh, look at that. That's so cute. Um, it's too hot f even sitting by the pool at the moment. It's, like I said, 38. I think even the water is boiling. So I um, we're staying inside. Uh, spring. So shall I take this? Mm, okay. I can get it out of the book without tearing it. Sorry for that noise. Okay, so let's cut tear this up a little bit. And get my journal out of the way. And grab my ruler and decide how much of this I want. Okay. See this and then this one is the building. Maybe I'll keep that little explanation.
I'm just staring it. Yeah. <laughs> Have I mentioned that it's hot? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. We will survive. Oh no. Okay, I intended to do that. Totally. <laughs> okay, so let's get the book back in and see. Yeah, totally tore my building. Anyway, where do I want this? And maybe this is too much. Maybe I should tear it down a little bit. I like that, but it's just too big for my page. And I want her to look that way. And the building, will the building go fit in here? Yes, it will. I can always have it kind of covering this, maybe. And the tickets, I had them over here, so let's do that. Um, the advertisement. But I feel like I need... Let's... I want to keep that little flower. Okay. I want to add a little bit of color on this side. So let's stir out this flower. I think it's a geranium, if I'm not mistaken. Oops. So if we have this here, the geranium down here with the tickets, maybe something like this. Okay. Something like that. My building over here. My advertisement. Okay, so the building needs to go a little bit over. Still have some of this Um, what do you call it? <laughs> wallpaper. Wallpaper left. And I'm wondering... I'm sorry. I'm kind of just going with the flow. Maybe add some ink and then add a little bit of water on here to see how that... Okay, so I'll leave that to dry. Okay, so maybe I should start gluing some of this down, then it would be easier to manage. A glue page and some glue. And but I'm wondering, do I want some lace here? And maybe this lace. Okay, I'll use this lace. Oh. Scissors. <laughs> I'll use this lace and then I'm going to cut it because it's too big and I think I want this side. It's funny very stiff lace. It's weird. And maybe I will just... I don't know what's happening to me today, but I'm dropping everything. <laughs> kind of uncoordinated. Just add a little bit of ink on it to make it a little, you know, just less, less white. Okay, so let's see. If I want the lace maybe this way and her, or do I want... No, I definitely want the lace first. So let's do the lace first. Okay. 
I'll do it all the way, the lace all the way up and cut this down and because I have the lace there I'm going to use art glitter glue to um, glue this on to the lace and the paper and this is thicker it's it's not cardstock but it's almost like scrapbook paper thickness this paper in the book I love this book um, absolutely love it let's just see where the edge of the page is okay with art glitter glue you don't have a lot of time to play around with placement so work fast okay got it down and then we'll do the building advertisement or brochure don't have any brochures okay we'll put that on there kind of want it on a bit oh do I want the brochure maybe this yeah because there's a lot of empty space on the top of this piece of the picture Where's the red ticket? I will find it. Um, so I have more of these little things that I can just add because we only need something that spins. We have that on there, but I'm thinking I might add it with the key, like two charms together, but this is a bit big. Anyway, we'll do the keys in a minute. Um, let's find something else that we can add on here, maybe on that in there, this up here, or maybe with the tickets, I want to use the tickets this way, should I add this in here with the tickets? If I find the red one, what did I do with it? Ticket. Oh, there it is. It is hiding. Okay, the tickets. Tickets and this over here. What does this say? Orkney. <laughs> Kinda has to go this way. It doesn't matter. I can. I just feel like I want. Um, okay. Oh, I have this little garden in here as well that I didn't use on my other on Junk Journal July. And then maybe we'll do Orkney in here. Okay. That's an idea. Maybe add some lace on this side. I think down here. OK. 
Okay. And Okay, let's glue stuff down because it's getting a little too crazy for me again. It with the book becoming so bulky. Nothing wants to sit flat on, you know, the it's not sitting. The book is just not sitting flat anymore. It refuses. Okay. And I said this one will do. I love this little image. So I thought my place would be garden. I love to sit in the garden and um, just, you know, stare out on my garden and drink a cup of tea or something cold when it's this warm. Maybe a juice. Um, and then this one. We want the tickets on top of the these two. And then the lace. Want the lace this way. Okay. It's coming. <laughs> um, you know, some of these I find just it takes a little while to f decide what you want to do, even if you have all your things put out and, you know, have an idea. It still kind of comes together once you cut the images out and actually place them on the page, you know, the page. Mm, what happened to you? So yeah, some of them takes a little longer, others faster. See, now I lost a ticket over there. A ticket again. Anyway, so it's coming. We're getting there. And then I want maybe this butterfly up here. Do I want the butterfly down here? Mm. Decisions. I think there. Okay. Butterfly is going up there. And then I have some ball pins, I think. Yeah, I do. And what will we put? Let's use uh, let's use this one. And we need to pick a little key. And I think I want that's too big, so let's use one of I'll use this one. This one a different kind of metal, but I think will be good. Should I add? No. Let's just do the two. And they'll be hanging on here. Oh. Okay. Okay. Do we need anything else? Maybe some washi? Maybe just here. And then a little bit over here. And yeah, I think that's it. I don't think I'm going to add anything else don't think I need a quote or anything. Um, do I want to add that to it? <laughs> no, it kind of feels like it's just hanging in the air. Okay. I am going to stop at this because I can keep going for the rest of the night, moving stuff around and not deciding on where I want to glue stuff on. So this is my Margaret Reed Miller 
um, weekly challenge. It is something that turns or spins, or it's this cog or the um, bicycle. A key is over here. A ticket of any kind. So we have these three tickets. Um, a portion of a brochure advertisement. So these are all advertisements and a building we have the building up there and a place here is my is garden um is my place oh look at how dirty my fingers are anyway thank you for joining me go see um search the hashtag hashtag 22 cwp29 or you can just say hashtag 22 cwp and you, it, the options will appear and you can see what everybody else is doing and I um, hope to see you soon and I hope stay cool, stay out of the sun and stay hydrated if, you, if it's warm where you are. And um, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.